Hi, welcome to Free Spirit and welcome to a special spirit message that came through earlier. Um, actually, this card came out in our spirit pick me up reading and then this message, all this whole message came through and it has been haunting me all through while I'm working and I just wrote it all down and I wanted to share it on this channel and one, it has, ever since I got it, it has been in the back of my mind all day. It's really um, influencing how I approach things, how I go about my day and I wanted to share it here in, in case it helps anyone else and also for a reminder, I want to see it in my face all the time. Um, so the spirit message I got was peace out, which I love, peace out, practicing quote unquote radical peace every day, no matter the situations. So it's peace out, practicing radical peace every day, no matter the situations. And this message, it was so beautiful and honestly so powerful and it was all at once that I'm going to try and convey it here and share it. So first it started, it was all about remember the good old days where we would be so frustrated and easily swayed or moved and annoyed by the annoyance of old life. Back in the normal times, our annoyances looked at from where we are now, we would be blessed to be annoyed by. And they're saying how we're practicing radical peace now, putting into practice every day how to let go of those things, obviously not in our control focusing on all that we are in control of, that we're letting go of petty annoyances and we're seeing the bigger picture of things, how we're increasing our capacities to love and show compassion and not be moved or shaken by what may disturb our peace, that we're digging deep to maintain that peace for ourselves with all that we are. And with that, we are able to outpour more of the divine parts of ourselves which will be creating the new creations of more love and peace for us all. Until then, we are practicing radical peace every day, no matter the situations, only building up our strength and endurance with each passing day. We can stay positive, we can stay peaceful, we can get through this day and every day practicing radical peace, which only naturally cultivates more. Remember to practice radical peace every day, no matter the situations, for yourself and others. Peace out in every way and in all ways. And I know this sounds really um, light and everything else, but then when I went through it in every sentence, it was so amazing. I mean, when you really think about the normal times back when we would just be frustrated or annoyed by little things, I and mean, they're not even on our radar anymore. They don't actually even exist at this moment in time. We would be blessed to be annoyed by it. I mean, they literally said that, and that is so true. And they're saying how we're practicing radical peace right now by putting into practice, like, if there was ever a time when there's so much not in our control that we're actually realizing of letting go of all the things that we're not in control of and focusing on all that we are in control of. And that was a capacity that we kind of got lost in the normalcy of life. We would constantly focus on things that we're not in control of. And so here in this weird circumstances, um, we really are forced to focus only on that we're in control of and we're letting go of all the other things and seeing the bigger picture of things. We're forced to see the bigger picture of things. Um, that we are increasing our capacities to love and show compassion. That's all that we're seeing for the most part of what's being poured out um, during this time is the capacity that we have to love and show compassion. And we are digging deep. I mean, they kept on saying what this times have brought us to, not to our knees, but to our hearts. We're digging deep to maintain that peace for ourselves with all we are and with all that we're able to outpour more of the divine parts of ourselves. And this is what the times call for. And that, the divine parts of ourselves, is what's actually creating the new creations of more love and peace for us all. And so that's why they're saying practice radical peace every day no matter the situations because you're digging deep into the peace you're standing in this seat of peace and greeting all with this radical peace and then you're coming from radical peace and the strength to do that can't be underscored enough they kept on saying the strength that we, with each passing day in the next sentence when they said only building up our strength and endurance with each passing day we can stay positive we can stay peaceful we can get through this day and every day practicing radical peace 
which only naturally cultivates more. It's like they're giving us the, the secret of when you practice radical peace, it only naturally cultivates more. So remember to practice radical peace quote unquote, radical peace. And they're saying it is radical. And let me tell you, I looked up the word radical and it literally is an agent of change. So they're saying to practice radical peace every day. Make no mistake, you are an agent, an agent of change by doing that. You're changing your energy. You're changing where you're coming from. You're changing how you approach things. You're changing how you react to things. You're changing what steps and actions you're taking. And that ripples out. And they're saying, remember to practice radical peace every day, no matter the situations for yourself and others. And peace out. And that's what they're saying. Peace out in every way and in all ways. And let me tell you, when this came through, first of all, I felt bathed in love and understanding and peace, 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 peace out. And I love the tone. I love um, the message. And But more than that, when I went back to work, it was in the back of my mind for the last couple of hours. So much so, I was like, okay, I'm going to share it on the channel so then you can kind of leave me alone so I can get back to work and concentrate. But once you read this and really drink it in it really changes how you view things it changes how you're acting it changes how you're responding it changes your reactions it changes where you're coming from and i love when it was saying how we're just getting stronger our endurance and our strength is getting stronger by the day every day that we insist on remaining peaceful that we insist on being strong and positive it only makes us stronger and they kept on saying that. They kept on saying, we have not been brought to our knees, we've been brought to our hearts. And bringing out more love and compassion and coming from peace, it only naturally cultivates more of it. Um, really, really beautiful. And I love peace out, practicing radical peace every day, no matter the situations, for yourself and others, peace out in every way and in all ways. And when we come from that, I mean, that's what we're doing. That's where you want to go live your life from. So I wanted to share this on the channel because, listen, I mean, since I got that message, it really has shifted me and made me so aware. And that is where we've come from. And I love when they said, you know, back in the normal times, I mean, look, think back of what a year ago you'd be annoyed by. We don't even have that experience anymore to be annoyed by it. I mean, we would be blessed to have that annoyance, right? Like someone cut you off um, when you're heading to work or um, some rude interaction. Um, I don't know. I mean, the things that would set us up or be annoyed, um, we don't even have that to be annoyed by, that blessing of annoyance. Um, and we have all these other things that are so magnified right now. And it's only making us really tap into peace 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 um what we're going through right now if we can claim peace for ourselves in this moment no matter what the situation um the whole world has been thrown up in the air and if we can retain our peace through this time um make no mistake that's what we're cultivating and how powerful is that i, I just can't get over how powerful we are by maintaining peace um in these times when we have the most that's out of our control that's what they're saying um Back then, we were annoyed with all these little things that were out of our control, and it took our focus, it took our energy, it took our attention, and we would just spin on it for days, for weeks, for whatever. And now, when we have the max that's so out of our control, this is when we're really learning not to focus on the things that are out of our control. We're digging in deep with all we are to maintain peace, to provide more love, more compassion, more peace and sanity, and all of that, and that is really building us up um that's what they were saying i mean it's angel of peace and here this card came out angel of peace and it literally says on the card peace angel is offering you peace right now from all the burdens you have been carrying release all burdens at our feet so you can feel lighter now and that's what they want us to be and that's what we claim for ourselves and you can see the moment that your energy shifts when you do that for yourself you're claiming peace for yourself no matter how crazy or chaotic the world is and they're underscoring create that every single day no matter what the situation and what strength and what endurance literally to stay positive to stay practicing radical peace every day no matter the situations it's only building up our strength and our endurance with each passing day we can stay positive we can stay peaceful 
we can get through this day and every day practicing radical peace, which only naturally cultivates more. So remember to practice radical peace every day, no matter the situations for yourself and others. Peace out in every way and in all ways. And this just affected me on so many levels that I just, uh, I feel like in the back of my mind, I'm reflecting on this all day, even when I'm doing other things. Um, so I hope I'm communicating this properly. I definitely wanted to share this message. I hope you receive it the way that I did. And um, peace out in every way and in all ways. I love this message. Uh, take care. Bye-bye.